How's it going everybody? The Mythical Pickle here, and welcome back to another Fallout 4 video. So picture this, I was chilling at home, formulating some absolutely diabolical video ideas, you know, the usual, and then it happened. All three of the brain cells I had left collectively gathered together to form an idea. What if I was a pickle? I mean, as far as you know, I already am a pickle, but I feel like our kind haven't been properly represented in any of the games we've played so far. So with that said, today we will finally step into the vinegar soaked shoes of our pickled brethren. All to answer the question, can you beat Fallout 4 as a dill pickle? Now, with no time to waste, let's lay down some ground rules for the challenge run this time around. To start off, we have some standard rules that are likely to be seen in future challenge runs. That is, no companions of any kind aside from quest mandatory ones, naturally. No use of power armor for any reason aside from quest requirements. Weapon bash is not allowed for any reason and I must stay in character with all dialogue choices and fraction decisions. And last but certainly not least, I must beat the main quest. Now for our more unique rules, the list is quite a bit shorter than usual. That's because the only rule this time around is that I must be a pickle and remain said pickle for the entirety of the playthrough. And just like my last challenge run, we will be running a few mods to help the game function a little smoother as well as match the theme we have set. I made it a point to only pick mods that will in no way make me overpowered or render the challenge useless, but rather make the challenge feel a little more fresh and engaging. Now with all that out of the way, Let's dive right in, shall we? Alright, so first things first, I hopped off the counter... Oh, uh, wait a minute. Hmm, I, I hadn't considered the fact that dill pickles don't have any arms or legs or any way to move. Hmm. Alright, well, no matter. That just means we need to get a little more creative. Uh, hey, 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 Codsworth. Codsworth, buddy. Buddy, Codsworth. Hey, uh, could you give me a little hand? I, uh, I seem to have misplaced my extremities. <laughs> Silly me. Uh, hey. Hey, hey, wh where the hell are you going? Uh, Nora. Nora, over here. Hey, why are they all ignoring me? Damn. I also forgot I lack any sort of mouth or vocal cords to form any speech. Hmm. Well, at least the counters are clean. And on that note, it looks like, sadly, you cannot beat Fallout 4 as a dill pickle. Quite a shame, really. I was really looking forward to blowing up an entire science institution with all my pickled glory. Uh, but alas, if you enjoyed the video... Hey, you. Finally awake. Well, you stuck around this long. You know what that means? You're one of the greatest pickle knights among us. Come on, have a seat by the bonfire, and uh, here's a sweet roll and a tankard of Piccolonia's finest ale. I'm sure you could do with some rest, it's been quite the journey. Hey pickle knights, I hope you didn't mind a bit of satire humor to celebrate this channel's 1000 sub milestone. Wow. Even saying that out loud doesn't feel real, but seriously, a thousand subs? That's absolutely mind-blowing, and the Pickle Knight Fellowship just continues to grow as I'm recording this. Man, it really feels like just yesterday I pushed that record button for the first time, and I am glad I did. I want to just take a moment to thank each and every one of you for the support you guys have passed my way time and time again. From those that have been here since the very beginning, to the ones that have found me along the way. I, I quite literally couldn't have done it without you guys. And I've been doing my best to make the very best content for you guys. And I'm so happy to see how well it's been received. And hopefully you guys caught a couple smiles here and there. After all, that's why we're here, right? To get serious for a minute... This isn't just about the subs, or the likes, or the views. All that is great and really helps spread the message, but it's not why I made this channel and that's not what the Pickle Fellowship is about. 
It's about making you all smile a little wider. It's about making you laugh a little bit harder than you would have without these videos. I know this world can be so f***ing difficult sometimes, but we always gotta remember that there's always a reason to smile. There's always a reason to wake up and enjoy your life for what it is. That's why I'll continue to create these videos for you all, and I genuinely hope you find some enjoyment in them. Whether it be my random comments, or my very slow speech cadence. This hobby of mine has quickly turned into a passion, and I'm so lucky to have such a strong fan base already. But mark my words, we're just getting started. I have big plans for the future of the Pickle Knights, and I cannot wait to see this grand journey unfold as we chart unknown lands and avoid the acute urge to jump out the window every time Preston wants to mark something on our map. Once again, I just want to thank all of you for supporting me and allowing me to do what I love. Now, let us continue our journey, for we still got a lot of ground to cover and many adventures to seize, my dear Pickle Knights. Oh yeah, and before you go, you already know what I'm about to say, but remember to smile, my friends.